All right, you guys, welcome back to the channel. We're here with some more Dragon Ball Raging Blast 2 mods, and today we have an awesome one because the homie LB Fury decided to create Goku Black as well as his unique transformation, Super Saiyan Rose, and check this out. He even updated the character portrait. I believe he got the images from Dragon Ball Legends. Could be wrong there. Make sure to let me know if I am wrong. Uh, which is also perfect timing because I believe Legends also just got a brand new Rose Goku unit. Yeah, <laughs> the Raging Blast 2 modding scene is just improving overall. Of course, I'll have LB Fury linked down below in the description. He has a whole bunch of other character mods, but again, this is like the first one I've seen that's this in depth because he also comes uniquely equipped with a brand new moveset as well as supers and ultimates. So normally, this is supposed to be Salsa's character slot, right? Cooler's henchman. And obviously he doesn't have any transformation, uh, but Goku Rose does. So that's how you know this is completely custom. Well, to be fair, he does have some of Salsa's super attacks just because of the key energy divine blade, whatever it's called. Yeah, that suits Rose Goku extremely well. He's also borrowing some other attacks from other characters, which we will see shortly. But we also have some new custom supers. <laughs> yeah, make sure to leave a like on today's video. I'll greatly appreciate it. So we're just going to be doing this CPU versus CPU because they're going to be showcasing the characters a lot better than me. Uh, uh, Goku Black versus Super Saiyan Blue Vegeta. For the first fight, the second fight will probably be Super Saiyan Rose Goku versus Blue Goku. Uh, well, he might transform during battle. I think CPUs can transform, right? Could be totally wrong. But check this out. The model design. The Patara earring. The time travel ring. Like, the detail second to none. The outfit. <laughs> hey! So, Goku has a power ball. Full power energy wave. A unique rush attack, which again, I believe is coming from another character. Instant transmission and for his ultimate Rose Kamehameha. Oh, what was that? Yo! Oh, Vegeta's using Brave Punisher! But what was the other super attack that Goku was about to use? Oh, into maximum flash! The damage! So check this out. You can already see Goku Black's unique aura. This is completely custom because you had to install the aura as well as the super attacks. It's a lot different from all the other character mods that I've been showcasing because those were just model designs, right? They didn't have uh, different supers from other characters. Uh, the moveset wasn't the same as the base character that the mod took over. Stuff like that, right? So as for Rose Goku's moveset, he has Rose Kamehameha, but instead, uh, it being the ultimate, it's a super. Rose Spirit Sword, which I believe is Vegito's super attack. Hey, we got the clash. Let's go. Oh, no. Yo, Goku needs to transform. Please. Please transform. <laughs> but moving on, uh, he has Explosive Wave and for his ultimate, Rose Rush. I came up with that name. I believe his ultimate is Salsa's ultimate, which, again, makes sense because of the... Uh, he a sword, whatever it's called. But there it is. There's the uh, Goku Power Ball. Hey, so I think that's the only unique attack, or you know, custom attack that this Goku has. Every other attack is coming from another character, which is totally fine. I prefer it being that way instead of having, you know, the character have the same supers as the character the mod is over. Again with the power ball. Oh no, Vegeta ruined it. All right, uh, I don't think he's gonna be able to transform. Vegeta did activate his high tension mode or raging blast mode. So let's see if he's gonna utilize uh, all the different cool combo strings. Oh my gosh, the damage! Yo, power ball does mad damage. <laughs> it looks like he's gonna lose though. He might lose. He might. If he transforms. He'll probably save himself, but it doesn't look like it. And... Oh! Yo, he has one sliver of health left. What the heck? Yo, he's still fighting. <laughs> Please, use an ultimate. Charge all the way. Go into Raging Soul mode and use the ultimate combo string. Oh, Vegeta! Oh! Oh! He crashed! Please! No! 
because that would have been cool if it ended off with a uh, beam struggle, right? No. Oh, that was nice. All right, round two. Let's just go ahead and select Rose Goku this time around. <laughs> you just know your place. <laughs> Wait, he still has the Salsa dialogue, though. But his his uh, posture is way different from his original form. And look at that! He's glowing with energy! Yo, his outfit is emitting the Rosé aura. Do you guys see that? That's also something different that LB Fury is working on. Because if we just do this quick comparison uh, between the two characters, Super Saiyan Blue Vegeta is completely bodying Rosé Goku right now, but... Uh, going back to the comparison. Oh, look at the aura! Hey, the rose aura. Dodge that, please. Thank you. I appreciate you. <laughs> but, again, blue Vegeta doesn't have the blue energy emitting from the model, right? It's just like like he's not powered up. But if we take a look at rose Goku, we can see the rose glow around the outfit. Do you guys see that? I'm not talking about the aura. Like, we literally have this glow effect around the character, which is extremely different and unique. Again, something LB Fury is working on, just trying to, uh, you know, make the character mods feel like a true Raging Blast 3 game out here, right? Of course, starting with the character portrait, you can even see on screen right now, uh, his health bar and key bar. We have the character portrait in the middle, you know, starting to include different supers and ultimates from other characters into his mods to make the best authentic character that he's trying to create again for example he's using um some goku supers as well as saza's super attacks with the keyblade and stuff i believe he also has the keyblade combo string so hopefully he uses that here shortly I'm probably going to have to take this into training mode and show all the cool stuff because, yeah, he's not utilizing anything at the moment. Use your ultimate attack, please. <laughs> all right, all right. I will take this into training mode. Don't worry about that. Oh, that charge, though. Extremely awesome. They're both charging. A, A. Please, full power. Ultimate. Ultimate. Oh, dodge that. Oh, at least he blocked it, which is fine. But please use your ultimate. It's a uh, Rose Rush, <laughs> which is a name I came up with. It, again, it's supposed to be uh, Saza's ultimate, but there it is, Rose Kamehameha Super version. Of course, if he was in his base form, uh, Rose Kamehameha would be the ultimate. And there it was the Rose combo string. Did you see that? The Divine Keyblade. That was awesome. Do it again. Oh! Point blank. He tried to transform into Blue Evolution. Oh, what the heck? Is he about to transform? Oh, he did! Blue Evolution! <laughs> what the... <laughs> the timing! But shout out to Keep Trying for creating that specific model of Blue Evolved Vegeta. Oh my gosh! Yo, he's using the Raging Soul combo! No! Please don't lose again, Rose Goku! We need you to win! Wait, why did his character portrait change all of a sudden? He, it's Scouter Vegeta now. You guys see that? <laughs> hey, that's fine. That's fine. Oh! Explosive wave? Ultimate! Ended off with an ultimate! No! Alright, I at least want Rose Go Goku to win. He doesn't have to finish off with style. Just win, please. Is he superior to... Blue Evolved Vegeta. I highly doubt it. He wasn't supposed to transform, but that's confirmation right there. CPUs can actually transform. I just realized that. <laughs> so they can actually transform. They just don't use it often, which is very unfortunate. No! He just wasted all of his key by flying up to the sky. Uh, no! You need to be victorious, Goku. <laughs> or Zamasu, whatever. Oh yeah, I believe LB Fury is creating a merged Zamasu character mod. Yeah, that looks completely awesome. Can't wait to showcase that. I guess he's just doing uh, the Future Trunks arc. But there it was again, the Rosé Divine slash whatever. <laughs> ultimate! Ultimate! Please! It, the, the health is pretty even. 
So whoever uses the next combo string or super attack basically wins. Unless you drop it like Vegeta. <laughs> Wait, I don't think... Yeah, I don't think characters can use supers and ultimates while in Raging Soul Mode. So that's very unfortunate. Unless, of course, you equip the item. But... It seems like Goku's gonna win. Maybe. Maybe, please. No! Don't lose. <laughs> Uh, Alright, just just finish this already. Yeah, there it is, man. Alright, here's Powerball. Look at that! <laughs> How crazy is that? We have full power energy wave. With a different camera angle, it seems. I think this move is coming from Curlis, right? We have... Oh yeah, this is the rush attack that we never got to see. Uh, but it's definitely a close range, and here it is! Which I believe is also coming from Turles. Next move, we have instant transmission. Let's go. Look how cool that is. Behind you! And the ultimate attack. Again, Rosé Kamehameha. Could be wrong, but I think that was a custom animation. Look at this, man. I like how we get that rosé glow. So we have, again, rosé Kamehameha. The super version. Uh, we have... Uh, this is the rosé spirit sword that I was talking about. You see how he modified the color of the Spirit Sword into Rosé? Pretty awesome. This is the other rush attack. Last super we have is Explosive Wave. Let's go ahead and charge and use the ultimates, which is Rosé Rush. Wait, what the heck? That's not the ultimate. My bad, my bad. Um, here it is. And this is the cool, uh, Key Divine combo string. Oh, 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 oh! Ah, look at that! Look at that! Now, again, this one right here is specifically coming from Salza. But not the entire moveset, as I stated before. Uh, see? Wait, it might be coming from Salza, to be honest. <laughs> I don't think so, though, right? So this is it for today's video. Hopefully you guys enjoyed. As always, thank you guys for the immense support. And I'll catch you guys in the next video. Peace.